the fact that the, there is 9-11 in everyone's shared history, and we now know that was a, we went and waged war when th what the act was, and it was just hard to conceive this, which was a band of thugs, uh, of these terrorist barbarian thugs uh, connected into a criminal network. And instead of doing what one would do in, you know, injustice that works when you're going after uh, a syndicate of, of thugs, right? right. Uh, we approached it as a nation state, you know, who had no real nation state. We approached it in that way of like, this is how we're going to resolve it. We're going to go into warfare like nations do against one another. And this is the same thing. It, that's the other part of this. So with Bibi and with the IDF and with the with his administration, with this everyone that's in leadership and making calling these shots, it's it's it is that test of like you have to look at the philosophy underpinning what they're doing, because the only thing that if you're standing in their shoes to understand not be them, but to understand their motives and, and their actions and what they're doing, if it is all Palestinians are educated and they educate their children to become Hamas and to hate Jews. And we have to stop that. And that's what we're fighting. And that's what we're stopping. And you can constantly, I'm listening to their spokespeople constantly come back. And BB spokespeople constantly come back and refer to how children are raised and radicalized to become terrorists, all Palestinian children. That that's the, that's the language of genocide. 